bow and arrow have come a long way since the Stone Age. In the 1960s, an American engineer had his hands and cables to produce what is now known as the compound bow. Yeah. Hey, Mom, would you like a Pepsi? With this new bow, archery yeah. entered a whole new era. Yeah, I guess I could take one. Okay. You can get that later on today. Substantially. Next, once you yeah, get once you get done with your breakfast, the uh, the, the horses would like to uh, be, be uh, brushed out. The film dissolves, and the camouflage-style graphics are now afloat. Machinery dips the bow risers into the floating artwork, and the graphics I'll adhere to them. You're doing great. Now covers the entire surface, including all the crevices. After a wash and dry, <coughs> the risers are sprayed with a clear acrylic coating. <coughs> In the meantime, a technician prepares <laughs> 10 bow strings so at once. Down. There Each we go. strain will be made of 20 synthetic strands. It's good. He ties the fibers to the prongs of a wheel. Mm. And as it turns, it winds the 20 fibers.